Hello YouTube people and everybody out there that watches my channel. I'm going to do the Holly Jolly Holiday tag. And I wasn't tagged by anybody to do it. I just saw a few people's tags and it looked interesting so I decided to do it. And the first question is, favorite Christmas movie? It's A Christmas Story. That's my favorite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like the part when the San he he goes to Santa Claus, and Santa Claus um hits him in the butt and pushes him down the slide, and he goes, "You shoot your eye out!" Ha 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 ha. That's funny. Are you on the naughty list or the nice list? I'm on the nice list. There's no reason for me being on the naughty list. Show us an embarrassed Christmas card. I don't have a Christmas card, but I do have a Christmas photo, and it's of me and my brother William. I don't know what age this is, so, but it was when I was little. And then it says, have you ever had a white Christmas? Yes, I've had a white Christmas, especially in the Poconos where it snowed and it was so nice coming down and you're toasty warm in your house, having your hot chocolate and nice dinner and, and breakfast and all that. And also um, upstate New York where I lived and my dad would trample out to the pigs and the goats and the, you know, turkeys and chickens and feed them. Where do you usually spend your holidays? I usually spend my holidays um, here in Massachusetts and people come to me for the holidays. Play or sing your favorite Christmas song. Um, the only one I can think of is Jingle Bells, Batman Smells, Robin Laid an Egg. That's about all I remember that one. Um, do you open any presents on Christmas Eve? No, I don't open any presents on Christmas Eve, but my son does. You know, my kids do. Um, he opens one. And usually he's happy for about an hour. And then he's asking for more to open up. But we don't let him. Can you name all of the Santa's reindeer? Uh, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Common, Cupid, Donner, Blitzen. And the most famous reindeer of all, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Had a very shiny nose. And if you ever saw it... I'll stop with that. <laughs> Uh, what holiday traditions are you looking forward to most this year? Really don't have a holiday tradition. Just having people come over and enjoy the day with your your loved ones. Is a Christmas tree real or fake? It's fake. Don't have room for a real one. So I, we got a small fake one. And the cats probably climb. I have five cats. So I'll bet you they all climb if it was real. Hands down, what's your all-time favorite holiday food and holiday sweet treats? Oatmeal chocolate chip cookies are my all-time yummy favorites. I eat so many of them that my tummy hurts. I love them. And eggnog. Gotta have that. Be honest. Do you like giving gifts or receiving gifts better? I like equal. I like to give and receive, but I like to do it equal. Um, I like to see people open their gifts and see the expression on their face to know if they liked it or didn't like it. So that's fun. And picking out things that I think they would like. Sometimes you go find something and you go, hmm, I think they like it. And sometimes they do like it. I'm good at giving gifts. Show us your tacky Christmas attire. I don't really have a tacky Christmas attire. Sorry. What would be your dream place to visit for the holidays season? Dream place to visit will be any place that has lots of lights and decorations. Does your family have a special holiday recipe you like to, to help make? Not that I can remember. Growing up, there was quite a few recipes, but I never helped make them because I was always in the way. And, my, and everybody would say, go find something to do. Get out of my way, Heidi. But no, I really don't have anything traditional like that. Um, are you a pro present rapper or you fail miserably? Fail. I try my best. People like what's inside more than how I wrap it. But I really try my best. Sometimes I use too much wrapping paper when I shouldn't. But I do the best I can to wrap things up. So I try. It's all that matters. Most memorable holiday moment. Most memorable holiday moment is when we were in upstate New York. And had the family together. You know. And my, my son and daughter. You know, and my dad and everybody was there. And we each take turns opening a gift and showing the gift to everybody. My dad wasn't too thrilled on doing that because he wasn't into wanting to wait. But 
my mom would do it, my aunt, my two kids, and then me, and then my ex-husband, and, you know, and then my brother and my dad, all, and his, you know, we all take turns, but my dad wasn't really into doing that. But it was fun doing it. Uh, most of them, what made you realize the truth about Santa? What made me realize the truth about Santa is when, when I wrote him a letter of things I wanted, and I put it up on a, it was either a fake um, fireplace or a mantle or something, and then the next day I woke up and it was still there, and I'm like, oh, why didn't Santa take it? That was what I thought, and I didn't say anything, but then another year, the next following year, I saw something lay out, or my, my mom didn't, the closet door was open just a little bit, and I saw something there. But then I ended up seeing the same thing at Christmas time, saying it was from Santa. And I'm like, wait a minute. And then that's when I started putting pieces together and realized that Santa wasn't Santa. Do you make New Year's resolutions and do you stick to them? New Year's resolutions, I say what I want to do. And then two months later, it's like, forget it. It's too much effort. But I do take coins, put them in a bag, wrap them up, and put them on a windowsill. And then they'll sit on the windowsill, and once it's supposed to give you good luck if you leave them overnight, and that means you never have you never go without having money in your pocket. So I take the coins, put them in. Like I said, I put them in a uh, sandwich bag, put them on the windowsill, and then the next day it'll bring you good luck of never having no money. What makes the holidays special for you? Just having everybody get together, no fighting, no arguing, just a good old time of eating and getting fat and opening gifts and enjoying the music and the TV and the video games or whatever you want to do. So, and I was looking over here to look at the questions if you're wondering why I was looking off to the side. But this was a fun tag. I tag anybody that wants to do it to do it. You don't have to do it, but it's fun, you know. And I um, hope you all have a good Thanksgiving and I'll do more videos a couple of days after Thanksgiving. And don't eat too much turkey, but enjoy yourself and your families. Thank you.